Hello guys, how are you doing today? You are welcome back to Javins TV. Don't forget that this is Javins TV live today. And I want to assure you that I will be bringing news on this channel, especially breaking news. Thank you very much for staying tuned. Right now we have a very interesting um, caption which I would like us to discuss concerning Mazen Abdekano's trial of yesterday, failed trial, of which the DSS refused to produce him for the trial and at the end of the whole thing, the case was adjourned to October 21. Right now, this lawyer, Aloy Ejimako, has something to say. He said Nigerian law rubbished case against Namde Kano. You know, Aloy Ejimako is Mazen Namde Kano's lawyer. And for him to have said this, that means something must have happened. Right now, we will go deep into what actually led to this statement. Aloy Ejimako, a counsel to the embattled leader of the proscribed indigenous people of Biafra, Mazen Namde Kano, has revealed how the Nigerian law backed the secessionist in the treason felony case filed against him by the federal government. Ejimako, who addressed reporters on Monday at Federal High Court Maitama Abuja, where Kano was expected to resume his trial, said no Nigerian can be tried for any offense that is not supported by written law in the country. According to him, a section of the Nigerian Constitution, African Chartered of Human and People's Rights, Ratification and Enforcement Act Chapter A of Nine Laws of Federa Federation of Nigeria permits self-determination. He noted that the Article 1 of same chapter mandated the government to support its citizens exercising the rights. Let's get this clear. Trial of what? Nothing can be built on nothing. We have made it clear. The council representing the four other defendants have made it clear in their applications that the main charge treasonable felony is not supported by any law in the Federation of Nigeria. It is there in the Nigerian constitution. No Nigerian can be tried for any offense that is not supported by written law in the country. Now we have another law in this country. It is called African Charter of Human and People's Rights. Ratification and Enforcement Act Chapter A of Nine Laws of Federation of Nigeria. Article 20 of that chapter made it clear that all citizens of Nigeria have the right of self-determination. I'm not sure the offense of Attorney General, the office of the Attorney General of the Federation is aware of that. An article, I said that the Nigerian state must do everything possible to assist the citizen or the country in exercising that right without any hindrance. So the postponement and rejection of bail is what we are considering, he said. Hmm. Oh my God, you all have heard this. This is really coming from a renowned lawyer, Aloy Ejimakon. I wonder why they could not produce him yesterday. Maybe this could be one of the reasons why they could not produce him for him to face his trials. But whatever it is, I know that victory will come at last. My dear people, kindly help me share these videos as I will be right back. 